Hey friends, welcome to part two of this special India vlog. Everyone was getting very excited because my cousin, Tanajana, was getting married and I was the best man. We called it a small, thin Indian wedding because only a thousand people came across two days, which I guess is quite small for Indian standards. The preparations were in full swing a few days out from the wedding. What are you doing, Amma? Punching holes. Oh, 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 oh. He's got that. blue handed. Let me say, is this a good skin? Red handed. Oh, yeah. He's got blue handed. Blue handed. Is that a joke, yeah? Yeah. Attempted joke. This is a pandal, which is a tradition when there is a wedding in a household, and on the sides there are banana plants. This is with the lights on. This was an intense family meeting the night before, where Tanjana's dad was explaining how the motorcade should arrive at the church. And afterwards, we unwinded together with a game of code names. Yeah, it's a lot of pressure. Are you? <laughs> then on the morning of the wedding, we were decorating the car. After taking a few photos, we got to St. George's Cathedral and we were greeted by this camera drone tracking our car. Like all it needs is one laser pointer at our Here's some photos of us going into the church. You can tell that I was a bit confused lol, but we made it in. I didn't actually have to do much as the best man, aka the Marple Tolan. I just held the mic during the vows. <laughs> Here is the happy couple together and we took some photos outside. Then we went to the first reception in Savera Hotel. Like, why, why, why are you in this vlog? Why am I? In this vlog. Why am I in this vlog? Because Rohan is very famous and I want to be a part of his vlog. And of course you are my cousin's son. Okay, so what's your name? Sunita. Wow. Okay. Wow. <laughs> How are you enjoying the wedding? So far, amazing. amazing. I'm waiting for the food though, but so far, amazing. Are you proud of uh, Tanajana and Sarin? Totally. I'm, I'm hoping to get to know her, but of course, Tanaj. <laughs> The couple did another walk in and there were camera people running around everywhere. Here's a classic cake cutting and then yet more photos. This is quite typical in Indian weddings. After the ceremony, there's a massive queue of people wanting to wish the couple on the stage and take photos with them. This usually lasts several hours. And of course, there was a ton of food. Whoa! <laughs> Swaggers! Yeah, don't touch it. On the next day, we had another ceremony, and here's the montage from the day. For a lifetime of our love you, two hearts, one beat, you whisper to me, be mine. For a lifetime, it's the little things that make our hearts beat. It's like I can hardly breathe when you say Guys, I hope the first day of marriage has gone smoothly and that no arguments have broken out just yet. Lord Jesus, thank you so much for this beautiful day and for the gift of marriage, for all the joy that, and love that it brings. Thank you for showing us such amazing love and grace and for giving us a taste of heaven on earth through the act of holy matrimony. On how to have a successful marriage and it took me about 10 to 15 years to work out. So I'm giving you a head start here. So the answer to a happy marriage is actually very simple. Remember that your wife is always right. Secondly, the way to keep a married life ticking along very well is to let Tanuj think that he's making all the decisions, but actually he's doing exactly what you want. This is my mum helping Sarinaka light the Kuttu Valuku, which is a traditional candle lit at Indian weddings. The rest of our time in India was travelling around the city, seeing various family and friends. <laughs> comes back again, my god. What skill? <laughs> Incredible India. I gave another talk, this time on the topic of Dobi Itch at the Sri Ramachandra University Hospital. And I was given another Puna Day. Last time I was made fun of by the family for my pronunciation of that lol. <laughs> the rest of the time we spent playing with my cousins. Vishnan provides some commentary for us. This is... For 22. Oh. Oh, yeah. 
Ritten, what have you got there? Huh? <laughs> it's dry ice, isn't it? Yes, it is. Wow. Are you going to touch it? There's gas coming. Gas? Yeah. On one of the last days, we went go-karting, which was a rather thrilling experience. Abhi Mama, what do you feel about signing Someone this for? I just feel that uh, it would be, it's going to be a good one. So, <laughs> a good one? It's good, going to be a good race. <laughs> there are going to be other people also racing. Oh, we'll dash. No, we'll let them go. We'll, we'll dash. No, we'll dash. Oh, see, look how fast they're going. And oh. that's it, they have two oh. people. Oh. 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 Who's going to win? Don't know. Don't know. Obviously me. <laughs> After hanging on for dear life on the turns on the track, we flew back to the UK. On the plane, I was enjoying a Harry Potter marathon session. And here are some random clips from our stopover in Dubai. So anyway, that's the end of our holiday vlog. Take care and bye for now.